Once upon a time in a land seen as divine, the world stars were gathered as they ignored anything that mattered. Seen as gods among men, a young lad truly envied them. He hatched a bold plan to ascend beyond man, to influence them all using Photoshop and lies he thought small. Starting with a selfie a day and a substance stronger than whey, he began to hustle and grind until great success he did find. He no longer served beers for survival because his five minute eye workout all went viral. How does a fitness influencer start their day? Naturally, they're awoken by their internal clock, which tells them it's been a couple hours since they last checked in on Instagram. They immediately start to spam like every single post and react to unseen stories with hard eyes and fire emojis until it's time to make a post of their own. You have to let your followers think they hold the key to the cuffs by allowing them to believe they're intimately involved in the daily minutia through meaningless polls whose results you're never gonna check. Good morning, everybody. I'm ready just to grind, you know how it is, but in order to do that, I gotta get out of bed. So should I go to bed the left side or the right side? Right side, left side, let me know. What should I do? It's time to use the washroom where you go from a person to a product, starting with the mirror, the origin site of every influencer's journey to stardom where once genuine transformation pictures have turned into slightly doctored, I just woke up selfies. Speaking of selfies, it's time for the day's first selfie. It might take 100 takes, but you gotta be 100% committed when a 10% affiliate link commission is involved, regardless if the product works or not. An influencer will be excited to vlog how they wake up at 5 a.m., their morning meditations, and their new go-to recipes that creatively attack another culture's cuisine. But that is just the content that they're trying to spice up. A day off from vlogging means they get back to the same basic boring stuff like anabolic French toast. Anabolic French toast is the fitness influencer as moderate creepiness is to every aunt's husband. I'm gonna wet this bread like it's my boxers after a viral vid. Maybe if I cut just the edges off the crust, it could be my own cookbook. As your follower count goes up, also your caffeine consumption is on the rise. So you can do stupider things faster and with more energy. You could be on the highway for 15 minutes before you realize you forgot your car in the garage. And of course, you have to post how much caffeine you actually drink and how addicted you actually are because it's kind of irresponsible, hopefully relatable, and I think, Funny? Good morning, guys. I'm just having my anabolic French toast and my third cup of black coffee of the day. I'm just so irresponsible, but I just wanna tell you guys about my new favorite sugar-free syrup. Absolutely love it. It blows everything else out of the water. It is my new go-to and I can't live without it. So make sure you swipe on up and save 10% at checkout using my link. You guys will not regret it, okay? Swipe on up. Okay. Another common signature is to use an excessive amount of sugar-free syrup. There's so much pumping through your veins that only another fellow influencer can qualify for a blood transfusion. And I will say, French toast is just a very pettable food. Oh, that's good. Oh, I know it's not the real thing, but when it comes to French things, it tastes a lot better than mine. <laughs> You're now layered in sponsored apparel and it's time to head to the gym for a collab and maybe even a workout if there's time. After all, what's the point of a Zoo Clout Share membership if it's not to build your brand? Pre-workout time, my favorite time of the day, taking some Green Apple Flight and some Endo Pump. If you guys wanna pick up anything BPN, make sure to use my link in the description to save yourself 10%. So we've had our pre-workout for the sponsor, but now it's time for a monster for the culture. So we have all of these monster energy drinks here, but every single time an influencer will pick the white one, no matter what, clearly taking the statement, not seeing color, a bit too far. Oh, I can feel the human horsepower, Kofi. Okay, so we've made it to the gym. The hood is up before our scheduled collab. Thankful the other influencers are on full on selfie mode right now because the last thing that you want is to be caught in an IG live without an impressive pump to allow your followers to doubt your cookie cutter program's efficiency. So we gotta kind of go around the perimeter, okay? Yeah, to the dumbbell rack. Okay? Got you.
Okay, so a fresh pump now acquired in. Can you actually quick story for me, Kofi? Yeah, yeah. You rolling, Kofi? Yes, sir. Yeah. Perfect. It's good. Dumbbells feeling light. Rocket emoji. Swipe up to pick up the program. 20% off today. Likely every day. <laughs> a fresh pump is now acquired. It's time to interact with Zoo's wildlife and see what kind of follower accounts we're mingling with. So hopefully there's enough clout in here to get a step closer to finding Bradley Martin. 12K. I'll take a photo with you, but don't tag me. Seven eighty two. Seven eighty two K? No. I don't even want to collab in this conversation, let alone a video. So it looks like the collab has arrived, and this guy is too young to even know who Blink-182 is, but his TikTok is blowing up so much, you think he's a long-lost Emilio sister. Nothing else beyond that really matters. Time for two minutes of copyright-free trap music that your girlfriend knows you can only keep up for 30 seconds. I wake up, flex, I'm down, that check, no drip, this, what? tell him run it up. No sleep, no rest. Might crash, might wreck. But first die, stretch. Tell them run it all. I wake up, flex. Thumb down, that check. No drip, this. Tell them run it all. No sleep, no rest. Might crash, might. Lunch time, aka finding the hottest place for a culturally different style of grilled chicken until there is a ring light that also acts as a heat lamp and influencer's greatest sacrifice is never being able to eat hot food ever again because the laws of thermodynamics wait for nobody, not even your five minute vlog b-roll. In social media, in order to take a few steps forward, you have to destroy everybody in front of you. So instead of staying in your lane and focusing on the value that you provide, you have to talk about the fakeness of the industry and how real you are. So you can be with your dream dinner guests, but you gotta go on IG Live and talk to your followers. What's up guys? So I'm here just having my chicken salad right now, but what kind of gets lost is the need for balance, to enjoy yourself. That's what being real is all about. Like my dessert right here. So I'm tired of all these fake influencers out there that never say that they cheat on their diet, have all this clean food. You have to enjoy all that life has to offer and enjoy it in a genuine and positive manner, like me. Mm. Have a good day, guys. You want it? We worked out today, we got the post-workout meal in, so technically the day's work is done, but the appearance of a 24-7 hustle never stops. So it's time to set up shop in a local coffee spot to simultaneously show off my dedication, but also most importantly, my relatability. You know, planning vlogs and diet swaps, it's not an overnight process. It's about 90 minutes and two coffees. Before we get into the planning process, it's time... It's time to look at today's influxes of offers coming through the email hotline. These are simply things I can slap my name on without any further involvement. It's a dream come true. Phone cases, the usual program, fitness trackers, and yoga mats. Yoga mats, Kofi, what do you think about that? Mm, I mean, you are kind of flexible. Your latest video ideas are even greater than usual. Certified bangers, if you will. Get your popcorn ready because it's gonna be a movie. My ancestry results just came in and it looks like I have several unknown family members I can now reach out to. Time to see what my second cousin's father-in-law eats in a day. Quick little pro tip guys, if you ever have to resort to going to Starbucks, I recommend giving a fake name. While I love being recognized and talking to my fans, I like to focus on the creative process at hand. All right, see ya man, thanks yeah. for today. No worries, that's where yeah. you up to now. I gotta go film uh, this like date night vlog with my girlfriend. That sounds sad. Yeah, yeah see ya man. It's dinner time with the girlfriend. This is ridiculous. How am I supposed to make a bay post if she's not even gonna color coordinate with the food? At least wear something low cut. My coffee stories can't be the only thing carrying my content. Why is this man trying to out angle his food in all my posts? Buddy, the animal's already dead. There's no competition. You've already won. Matching stories are posted with hearts and declarations of adoration. However, behind the scenes, she's breaking up with you. She says it's because you keep on calling date night clouds, but in reality, you know, her views are down and a breakup video is guaranteed number one. For some reason, she storms off when you tell her this. She didn't finish her food. You guys both already ordered desserts. So the vlog is now turning into surprise 10K. Hey, 
double the content. Back to where we started with my nighttime routine before I go to my bed and scroll through Instagram for the next couple hours before I struggle to go to sleep due to the fear of cancellation. And now with the story told of how an influencer's day can unfold, it's time to steer clear as his clout will soon disappear. The views will go down and like his French toast, his TikTok will drown because nobody will care once the viral hit isn't there. Wish him good luck in the next one, possibly a place where threads come undone. It might not be the magic he'd like, but at least there'll be a collab with him, Mike.